Hi, my name is Bruce Stewart. I'm a technical service manager with FMC Corporation. I'm located out of Choctaw, Oklahoma. I cover all of Oklahoma and Northern Texas Panhandle with FMC. Well, today I'm out here in central Oklahoma in a peanut field and wanted to talk to you about disease control. Diseases are an important part of trying to grow and raise pe peanuts. They can reduce or rob yields significantly and need to be paid attention to on a preventative basis. So we don't want to wait until we see diseases, but approach them now. Uh, these peanuts were planted about uh, six to seven weeks ago. So now is an optimal time to begin the fungicide application regime. With peanuts, we have three key diseases. We have early and late leaf spot, which as you can imagine occurs on the foliage. And then we also have southern blight that occurs in the soil. These three diseases are comprise most of the yield robbing impact on peanuts here in Oklahoma in the northern Texas panhandle. Well, today I kind of wanted to talk to you about Lacento. Lacento is a new fungicide that uh, FMC has brought to market uh, in the peanut market to help control diseases. It's uh, comprised of two different active ingredients, uh, bixofen, which is a SDHI chemistry, group seven, and then we also have flutriophol, which is a group three or a triazol chemistry. Flutriophol is one of the most systemic and longest lasting fungicides that's on the market today. When you combine that with the SDHI chemistry or bixofen, you have an excellent product providing good protection throughout the whole season. Also, it's gonna be in the plant, not gonna be able to get washed off from irrigation or, or rainfall. With the Cento, we go out about 5.5 fluid ounces per acre and work that into a spray program. Usually in Oklahoma and Northern uh, Panhandle of Texas, it's usually about five different treatments. And we like to have Lacento in early into that program, maybe the second, third, or fourth treatment would be Lacento and use your other uh, existing fungicide products. So it's going to be kind of an integrated approach with Lacento into your current uh, fungicide program. With Lacento, we like to see it go out with a NIS surfactant, usually about a half percent volume to volume. It can be applied both ground, aerially, and uh, through chemigation. Through ground, we like to see about 10 gallons per acre. Aerially, usually about five gallons per acre. So I wish you the best in raising these peanuts disease-free, getting the biggest yields you can out of them. And I think with a good disease program, you will be able to accomplish those objectives. Thank you.